Question 17. Explain why you would expect the first ionization energy of sodium to be less than that of neon. So neon has a full outer shell or stable octet of electrons and each electron is held strongly to the atom. So the energy to re remove one electron is very high. So it's got a very stable electron configuration. So it means that the energy used, needed to remove one electron is very high, okay? Sodium has only one electron in its outer shell and by its removal, a filled shell with a stable octet of electrons is formed. So by removing the one electron, its stability is actually increased, okay? So sodium may actually want to give away its electron. So the outer shell of sodium is also further from the atom's center and the valence electron is more weakly held. Okay, so it's not very strongly held because it's so far away from the center of the atom. Thus, the outer electron requires less energy to remove it than any of those in the neon outer shell. Okay? So the main thing is that the neon outer shell is stable and so it, for, for many physical reasons, it is very stable and thus taking one of those electrons out is very difficult, so it takes a lot of energy. Okay?